talk now to the adventures of Rockford Rodent, coolest in the schoolest. See as he fights with his fellows and does tremendous damage to their jaw. Look out, Glass Jaw. You will be taken for a spin down memory lane to the hospital. Watch as Rockford hits a switch. Fascinating. I wonder if it opens a door to the east. Always to the east, Rockford. Defeat the soup can if you may, if you dare, which you do. Daring do. Oh, don't lose your patience, Rockford Rodent, or you might die in lava, which kills you. No, first it takes away your hair, and then it hits you again. So it hits you two times at once. So be careful of that, Rockford. I don't want to call him Rocky anymore. I want to call him Rockford and talk in an accent. I don't know how to place the accent, but I shall. That's not how hair works. But these are how crushing things work. Look out, Rockford. You'll be crushed into putty. Killed before your time. And nothing you could do can stop it. The flames consume you, Rocky Rodent! And so do the stompers. Look at you get stomped. Like that! Totally stomped. Let's try it again, shall we? But this time with less dying. Or you know what? More dying! Because that's what happens to Rockford Rodent! He dies! The game will see to it. You cannot hope to survive the flames. They give you like two seconds of invincibility. And then what have you? Scorn. Lots of scorn and cabbages. You like cabbage, don't you, Rocky Rodent? No? Oh, wait, yes, he does. He likes all kinds of food, I, I suppose. Cabbages and scorn. That's on the menu today with Let's Play Rocky Rodent. And getting crushed by that thing again. Because I can't get enough of it. Look at that facial expression. I'm so disdainful of our hero. Just utterly disdainful. This is why it's a bad idea to invade a factory. It's full of heavy machinery. Completely unsecured. How anyone works here and lives, I'll never know! But I do know this. The machinery is designed to kill. And make chili. And kill. But mostly kill. See how dead he looks? Dead to the world you are, Rocky Rodent! Dead to the world! Ha <laughs> ha! You'll never leave Eurasia alive, dear fellow! And now for our last life, where we will get killed by lava, flames, or perhaps stomping. We'd sure love to get stomped by the ceiling thing, wouldn't we? Eh? What's that? You don't want to? That's too bad! The game has no mercy of any sort. Just give up now, Rocky Rodent. You have no hope. Oh wait, what's this? A present! It won't save you! Nothing will save you! Ha <laughs> ha! Dear chap, you are deluding yourself! Also, you can't jump that high. Also, those are spikes. Be mindful of the spikes, dear fellow. Where do you think you're going, Rocky Road? There's nothing over there, except... <gasps> Spring hair! So what? You can jump high! You'll never win! You'll never survive! Okay, you'll survive against them, but that's about it. How do you intend to get past this one? Jumping! Jumping is all you know, Rocky. Jumping is all you see. You're just delaying the inevitable, dear chap. Delaying the inevitable. Oh yes, you'll perish, Rockford. You'll perish like no one has ever known before. 
Your Belmont whip can't save you now. Or can it? I guess it can! Or can it? I guess it can! Or can- no. Tilting at windmills, dear fellow. Tilting at windmills. I... Look, just whip that thing already. It's not rocket science, Rocky. Rockford Rodent, rocket scientist. And hair enthusiast. It's kind of weird, Rocky. <gasps> oh no, not again. Pecky has stolen your hair and your hope. How will you survive? You won't. No hope for Rocky Rodent. You better let Pecky hatch first. Yes! Pecky won't save you. Nothing can save Rockford Rodent. But we'll tune in for that next time. I'm Living Lobster. See you next time!